Petition to Cincinnati Opens coming to a close tonight. Ashley Smith is live at the Linder Family Tennis Center once again on the last day of tournament fun. What have the crowds been like this whole time? Okay, so today, of course, the last day, there's only three matches today. Two of them are already done, so the crowds are definitely a lot thinner, but we timed it out pretty well because the ladies' match just ended, and we're waiting for the men's match to begin, so people have kind of been flooding out of center court, and that's where I found my friend Ashlyn. Ashlyn, hello. How are you today? Hi, I'm good. How are you? I'm doing well. So we just saw, or you just watched, we were watching it on a screen, but you just saw the ladies' match. Um, the American didn't win, but it was still a really good match. You know, what did you enjoy about watching that? Uh, honestly, just the powerful serves and all the aces. Yeah. Super fun. Yeah. Okay. So tell me about, you've been coming here for a few years now. What do you enjoy so much about the Cincinnati Open? Uh, honestly, like for a tournament this size, it's so cheap because it's in Cincinnati. <laughs> Last year, getting to see the Wimbledon rematch was insane uh, in the finals. So super fun. This is in my backyard. So now um, we're kind of between matches. What are you going to do until the men take the stage? Definitely go have a Paloma. <laughs> Uh, kick back, relax, enjoy how nice these grounds are, and get ready to cheer on Big Foe. Okay, so it's Sinner versus Tiafo, but you said we call him Big Foe. Um, so have you been following them throughout this tournament? Who do you think is going to win? Yeah, so I watched him on Friday, and uh, he's a little bit of a wild card, but when he's on, he's on, and when he's got the crowd, he's going. So I'm really hoping that he pulls it out. Okay, and so that's like around 6 o'clock or so, right? Actually, the ladies went so quick so that, fast. yeah, should be able to start on time. So I'm going to let you go get your diploma. Is that what you said you're going to get? Yep. Okay, have fun and enjoy your time here. Thanks so much. Thanks, Ashlyn. Okay, so again, right now that uh, match just wrapped up, and so people are kind of flooding out here. They're enjoying a lot of the... Uh, obviously some good food, some good drinks, that kind of thing. So yes, while the crowds are a little bit thinner, these are the diehard fans, right? They're here for the championship matches. The men will take the stage round six. We actually saw Sinner, who is the number one ranked male. We actually saw him come in. And remember, Trisha, on Wednesday, I guess, I was at that area where the players enter. He did stop and he did sign something for everybody that was in line. I didn't see what Big Foe, as he's being called, what he did because we weren't there. But either way, I don't know. That was very nice of Center on the day of his championship match to sign all of those autographs. So we'll be in it live again coming up in the next hour. For now, I'll send it back to you. You know, you just talked to that woman by the name of Ashlyn. She could be a commercial for that place, talking about why they keep it in Cincinnati. But really, everybody you've been speaking yeah. with, I mean, not that you're looking for anybody to say anything yes. negative, but no one says anything negative at all. Yeah. It's all been like pretty much great. I'm so glad it's still here. It's great to be in Cincinnati. Well, and they just actually, we saw on the big screen, they were doing like the championship, you know, award ceremony. And they mentioned that it's here to stay. Everybody cheered loudly because of that. I mean, we haven't found anybody that said, I wish I was in Charlotte now instead of Cincinnati. So that speaks volumes. Can you tell it's been upgraded when you just look around? Absolutely. You know, even that screen that I was mentioning there, I'm getting eaten alive. Grab bug spray for coming out here tonight. Uh, that sh that screen there that shows the players as they enter in, that's brand new. And that, you know, if it's a player that's, you know, ranked in the hundreds or something worldwide, and they come through, you might not know them so well. Now you do. You know exactly who it is when they come in. And the championship balcony, that's new too. And we might be able to catch the lady, the woman who just won on that balcony here coming up a little bit later. All right. Good luck. See you a little bit. Ashley, thank you. Uh, quick reminder. Changing sports now, but we are the Bengals flagship station. You can watch the Bengals final preseason game right here. We're going to have full coverage of the joint practice with the Colts, which is tomorrow. And then our sports team is going to put together once again a one hour pregame fantastic show right before the game on Thursday. Then you can watch that final preseason game right here on Fox 19 now.